guys, I'm going to try to make some hummus. This is, I've made it one time before, but I didn't have the tahini paste um, to do it with. So I'm going to try another version, a recipe I got. It was off of allrecipes.com. It was submitted by Riemann or Riemann 9981. So I'm going to give this one a try and we'll see how it turns out. If you're interested, just stay with me. First thing I'm gonna do is uh, get my chickpeas out of the jar. These are some I canned last fall and um, get them rinsed and I'll be right back. Okay, some of the recipes um, tell you to take the shells or the skins off of them. And let me see if I can find what I can do. Like that, they just come off really easy. So I'm going to sit here for take me a couple minutes and get these off because they say if you do that, you get a creamier hummus. So that's what I want. So let me get that done and I'll bring you back. All right, guys. I got the holes off around the chickpeas. So we're going to put these in the Ninja Blender. I do not have a food processor. Hold on. Let me get the lid off. all those chickpeas in which should be a 15 ounce I just used the pint jar I can next we're going to do three tablespoons of the tahini sauce grab my tablespoon I already had it out get you up a little higher so there's one two and three trying to get it all off the just gonna let it sit there and drain while we do the other stuff. All right, next we need two tablespoons of olive oil. One, two, a tablespoon of lemon juice. calls for fresh but I don't have any lemons available right now okay next we need a fourth a cup of water three cloves of crushed garlic and just got them here we need and a half a teaspoon of cumin I'm gonna start with a half if that tastes good but I may add another half we'll see all right here goes my cumin all right let me put the lid on Everything locked down and then we're just gonna turn it on and let it process it's probably gonna be loud and I'm gonna push the stuff down on the sides so we can use all our I don't want to lose our seasonings or anything. Okay. 
Put the lid back on. taste so I can see where we're at and see how creamy I can get it to focus I think I'm going to leave this one. Let it set for a little while. I like the flavor where it's at right now. But um, let me get it out in a dish to put in the refrigerator, and I'll bring you right back. Guys, I added a little bit of smoked paprika and some parsley to the top. I'm going to put it in the refrigerator and let it set now for a while. And I'll try it after a while. I'll bring you back when I do. But what I've tasted so far, I really like it. Okay, guys, let's try the hummus. It smells really good. Very good. I think I would have done a little more cumin. The garlic flavor is good, but I would have added a little more cumin for my ta flavor taste. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.